right, this is Jamal of uh, Cooper Road Mini and Mini Mania. And we're taking the opportunity here to test run our Mini Moke engine. This is a 1345 cc, pretty high compression, um, with a nice Weber DCOE style carburetor here, as we can see. This is a 45 by OER, actually, a Japanese sort of a race version, race copy, if you will. And you can see the layout of our engine here. This is a uh, 1275 pre A plus, like a 70s version. Uh, bored out about 75 thousandths, resulting in a 1345. Uh, we've built a special four synchro gearbox. Usually would have a remote shift, but we've adapted our magic wand shift housing so that we can retain the original shifter location and feel here in this old English mini moke. And you can see here we've got a test stand. I've run this a few times, done a couple short clips already, but I want to take this chance to kind of show a few things. I'm going to start it up. I'm going to show you how to engage all the gears here so you can put it in all the gears. This is just nice to know how to do this. This will work for the magic wand or the remote style, anything with these external linkages. And then we're going to show the clutch actuation. This is a constant area of mystery for people. And we're going to show just how little movement it really takes to fully engage or disengage the clutch. Um, on these early pre-verto. This is the diaphragm spring style. Uh, that would be all the, the classic mini Mark I, Mark II, Mark III's uh, type of clutch linkage. All right, let's fire this up and uh, we'll show a couple things. It'll be noisy when it's running, so I wanted to do a little introduction. All right, let's hook up our uh, battery to the coil. We've got a, uh, a line running a starter also. And let's take a quick look.